Connection Card Pro allows you to create an unlimited number of custom classifications which can be used for classifying the people in your database. A classification can be applied to each person within your organization to define their role within the organization as a whole. Classifications can also be applied to each person's connection to any group to define their specific role as it relates to that group. Your Connection Card Pro account has a number of preset classifications. You can edit or remove these or create your own. One of your classifications is defined as the primary membership classification. You can change the name of this classification to anything you'd like, but this designation allows other parts of Connection Card Pro to automate certain processes by knowing what your members are called. Once you've finished setting up your classifications, you can begin using them in people, groups, and other modules. To assign a person's classification within your church, when adding or editing the person's profile, Choose an option from the classification drop-down under Organization Connection. Or, you can select multiple people from the person list or a custom list, scroll to the bottom, and choose the Edit Classification Batch action. Then choose which classification you'd like to assign and click Go. When creating a group, you will have the option to associate three different classifications with each group. Anyone who is part of any group can be assigned any of your classifications. However, these three classifications will be used specifically to help with organizing the roster or automating certain tasks. Choose a primary leader classification, a secondary leader classifications, and a default classification. All of these are optional if one is not applicable. The default classification is the classification individuals added to this group will be assigned if you do not choose another classification. Whether you call them staff, leaders or teachers for your various ministries, small groups and classes, choosing an option for primary and secondary leaders will make it possible for the system to automatically send emails, texts or notifications only to leaders and not everyone in the group when warranted.